Welcome to SV Union High School and Junior College. Students, last time we have studied the half part of the lesson odd one in. Let's continue with the second part. Let's continue to see further what happens between Malti and Rima. The following Saturday was the inter-house singing competition. Rima, who was participating in the English song category, was surprised to see Malti's name in the list of participants for the Hindi song category. Oily Plates sings also, she said snidly to Claire. Crooks, you mean, giggled Claire. They were to be proved wrong. Malti sang beautifully. She had a melodious and well-trained voice. Rima and her gang had decided to jeer when Malti sang. But there was such absolute silence, they did not dare to. So following Saturday, school conducted inter-house singing competition, where Rima has participated in English song category. And to her surprise, Malti too participated in Hindi song category, making fun of Malti, oily plates, girls sing. Also, Claire replied in a rough sound manner and started laughing. And much to her surprise, they were proved wrong as Malti sang beautifully. She had a very well trained and melodious voice. Rima and her gang decided to disturb her while singing, but there was complete pin drop silence in the competition, and no one bothered to disturb Malti or make fun of her while singing. Now, students, you must be ready with your pen and your notebook. Let's write the further meanings. Plates means twisted hairstyle. Snidly as a taunt. Crooks means unpleasant voice. Jeer, laugh at someone. These are the few meanings for this passage. Let's continue and see what happens next. They were sure to get caught. When Malti finished, the principal was the first one to start clapping, followed by the teachers and students. No one was surprised when Malti won the first prize. Rima did come first in her category. Somehow, she felt no joy. As the term progressed, it was abundantly clear to all that Malti was a bright child. She was quite studious and intelligent. She fared well in sports as well as in studies. Now students, let's read the whole part of the story. Pay attention. Her forte was mathematics. Her simple appearance belied a sharp and nimble brain. Slowly, many of the girls began seeking her help in mathematics, help which she readily and cheerfully gave. The teachers had liked the respectful, intelligent girl from the beginning. Now the girls from the class also befriended her. Not Rima and her clique though. They stubbornly disliked Malti. They were a stylish lot and nothing that Malti did could alter the fact that she was not their type. They never lost a chance to poke fun at her, particularly her English. Malti felt bad about their behavior. One day she was on the verge of tears when Rima mocked at her mercilessly because she said ax instead of ask. Her voice trembling. Malti said, I know my English is weak. Yours is good. Please, will you help me to improve it? I won't be able to help you, my dear, replied Rima with an exaggerated accent. Speaking proper English isn't easy for you countrified types. Malti's face turned red. She wanted to retort but could not find the right words. She burst into tears and ran off. That was horrid, Rima, said Shahnaz. Yes, agreed Neha and Claire roundly. Rima was shocked. 
her own friends had turned against her she walked off in a huff mrs sain found her subdued over lunch but decided not to ask anything reema knew that she had behaved very badly she was too proud to admit it even to herself in the last session everyone all the students you must be remembering that reema and her gang was about to court when she was done when malti was done with her singing but when principal was the first to praise her followed by the teachers and students she won the first prize where even reema received her in the english category but she was not happy she was jealous of malti as the term progressed now everyone knew that malti was a clever girl her overall progress was excellent she was good in sports as well as in studies malti was good at maths she was a simple she was simple with her appearance she was having a very sharp and quiet quick brain slowly now all the girls started talking and seeking help of malti and happily she helped them all teachers from start used to like her and now all the girls started becoming friends with malti leaving reema's group they didn't like they didn't like malti as she was not stylish she was a village type of girl they never missed an opportunity to make fun of her especially her english malti's experience regret about reema's behavior she was about to cry when reema laughed at her without being mercy because she made a silly mistake instead of saying ask she said ax and she was completely shaken and she confessed and accepted that her english is very weak very poor yours is excellent malti requested reema that will you help me to improve my english where reema replied behind behind her assent that learning english is not simple and for a silly girl like you it's too difficult so malti became very angry at her she wanted to answer but she couldn't find the right words so she cried and started to to start and started to run away from that place reema's friend shehna said this time you were very horrible even her friends like neha and claire agreed that now all her friends all reema's friends were against her reema was surprised and she ran angrily late in the afternoon for lunch mother looked at reema as she was very quiet for her lunch and decided not to ask anything reema knew that her behavior was very bad today but to confess her own mistake it was next to impossible as she was very proud for to her now students what do you think so who was right and who was wrong and to this perfect lesson which is the perfect thought yes correct to this lesson we have a thought that never judge a book by its cover now all the students are requested to please note down all the meanings of the next part i'll read the meanings please note it down the paragraph they were sure to get caught till befriended let's start with the meanings abundantly extremely forte area of perfection nimble that is quick fed means performed and belied means fail to give a true impression students are requested to note down all these meanings carefully in the class workbook let's come to the next paragraph the next paragraph starts from not rima till country five types meanings click small group of people alter change verge at an extreme limit exaggerated described as larger than real stubbornly means determined not to change poke fun to make fun trembling shaking accent way of pronouncing note down all these meanings and let's come to the last paragraph of the lesson the last paragraph starts from malti's face turned red 
till even to herself. Let us see the meanings of this last paragraph. Retrot, reply, roundly, empathetic manner, subdued, quiet and depressed, horrid, causing horror, huff, blow out air loudly. Students, we have written all the meanings and I hope so you must have written this also in the class workbook. Go through the lesson, read the lesson once again. Students, in the next session, we will be continuing with the meanings and question answers, the grammar part, language study, which is given behind the text. Students, you are requested to note down all the meanings, language study, grammar and question answers in the class workbook. Thank you.